What's up guys? So I have a, uh, I suppose a rather unfortunate video for you today. Uh, not showing any IPs, no. Nope, no, no IPs. Um, so, we're going to talk about a little bit about the Theater of Blood. And I know what you're thinking. Oh, we've done like 30 Theater of Blood videos. Why are we doing 31 Theater of Blood videos? <laughs> um, yeah, so I, I streamed the other day. And it was sort of the intro to... That was the wrong account. It was sort of the intro to Theater of Blood. What we did is we coded the items, got them stats and everything, and then checked out the monsters. And that's sort of where the issues arose. So, look at inventory. You can see that all of the items are correct now. They have their stats and whatnot. Um, so, that part is cool. And obviously, the items are probably the main thing people care about. I don't think the specific monsters... Um, matter as much as the specific items, but I will show you as a problem. Well, there's a, there's a few problems with the items. I don't want to say that they're perfect. For example, the data we have is probably when Theater of Blood was first released, um, because we have the version that has the longer skirt. The um, do I still have it up somewhere? I could find it. Um, the the newer one looks different. They they changed the way it looks because why did that open up a spade? Oh, is that because the wiki? Dude, the wiki man. Why did they like they they want you to use the new one, but then the old one comes up first. So then you click that, and then they just they trolled every post on purpose. Or that was possible. I misclicked, but but I'm just gonna assume that it wasn't a misclick. And it was a troll on their part. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, there we go. All that to do the same thing. So, you can kind of see that the legs part, um, oh, don't do that. You can see it's a lot shorter. I, I guess I'm, like, showing you the worst possible angle of it. Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, I guess that worked. Um, so yeah, you can see how there's, like, a lot smaller of a skirt part. So that's kind of annoying that we have that, the older one. Um, and then the second issue is the fact that the rapier, uh, has, it doesn't, they, they created a custom animation for it, um, because a lot of the old school players didn't like the rapier animation, the one that we have for our rapier. Um, and that's currently what this is using, so, it's a nice poke. Personally, I like to poke. I've always liked to poke. So that doesn't bother me, but I know a lot of people, you know, probably want the correct animation. So we don't have that data so we're missing those two things in terms of the items. I think everything else is okay. I don't think um, I don't think there's any other changes. Now I could be wrong because I don't pay as much attention to OSRS as I should. I try to check the Reddit every day to like you know look at the update posts and figure out what's new. But you know if you know anything about the Reddit of OSRS, you'll know that that's not always the best way to find new information because it's mostly just spam about stupid shit. Um, so, the items are working, the items are functioning relatively well, um, the issue stems from the monsters, so let me find a monster to show you, now, now, I've, I'm not 100% sure, because it's, it's, it's data, and data is something that I've never, I've never once done, Dark has done every single bit of data we've ever, uh, I don't know, I don't even know what the right word, downloaded, configured, added, I, I don't even know what, right, what the right word would be. But every single time we've ever done anything with data, he's he's done it. So he's 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 been the one to install it, and um, I'm pretty sure this is a data problem, which which is not good because, like I said, I've I've never done anything with data. It'd be this is gonna be my first mess around with it, if you will. So let me show you uh, pestilent blow, for example. And so when the first thing you notice is the T pose. Um, and then he has, like, his sort of animation sparkles around him. And that's why I think it's a configuration problem. If it was as simple as his standing animation, I don't think that the particles would be there. Also, I, I'm pretty sure I have some of the correct animations for some of these. So, I don't think that that's an animation problem. And, um, yeah, it just looks really bad. And, uh, I don't know how to fix that other than, a, than like, I think it's a, I, think, I just think it's a problem with their data. So we've got to fix that. And, um, it's worse with other ones. Let me show you an example. Um, here's, okay, so here's Sostig. And this was, this is the one that looks like, 
the Dark Beast, right? So yeah, this one is essentially just the Dark Beast. The problem is this weird swirl animation or whatever is, is like glitched up. And again, that's that's why I think it's a data problem, not like an animation problem or anything. Because that's just how the animation looks. So, the dude is essentially a night beast, or dark beast. Let's spawn a night beast right next to him, and I'll show you the comparisons. And I'll explain why I'm showing you the comparisons. Let's go right here, I guess. So, obviously, it's it's a little bit bigger, but that wouldn't really matter. You would you would you would expect their animations to be relatively similar, even with the horns and everything. I assume it just moves its head forward or swipes out with you with one of its claws. Either way, they're pretty similar, and the animation should be similar. <laughs> so let's see what happens when we do it. It's 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 just it's all bad. It, it's just a, it's a monster, dude. You gotta kill it with fire. It's it's really bad. I gave it the exact same combat animations as a Night Beast. Um, I also tried using the real animations from you know the, from the releases, and those didn't seem to be any different. Um, so you can kind of see wh where the issue is. So this is one of those things where if it was as simple as just getting the right animation, then it wouldn't be that bad. But I don't think it is. I think it's a, a data problem, and that's going to be a more concerning. So the question is, what do we do? How do we move forward? Um, well, for one, we need, we need the dark to get, you know, to, to find some time to help us out, or I, I'm just going to have to trial and error the hell out of figuring out data, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I don't even know where to, to, I don't know what, f what exact file I was looking for here, or, or not file, but browser, uh, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. I guess the theater blood wouldn't work. But anyways, my point is, it's no bueno. No bueno. <laughs> no, no bueno. Um, so, so what I'm thinking about doing, what's the, what's the point of this video, that theater of blood talk version 75, or however many of these I've done? It's to talk about the fact that we probably shouldn't do theater of blood, uh, so r we shouldn't rush it. So, um, we're at a point in the server play base where it's, it's, I wouldn't say it's our lowest point ever, because um, we started it off lower than this. Um, so if you're excluding that, then maybe it is our lowest. But when I came back about two, three weeks ago, um, I think we we were floating around like the low, the the low like fives, like the five to ten, and then the highs of fifteens. And we've we've slowly we've slowly gotten up there. Now we have you know we're actually at thirty one now. I think there's thirty five earlier, um, and then we you know at the night times where it's really dead, we get like fifteen. So we're slowly creeping up, and I'm pretty confident with with consistent updates that that that's what's gonna get us there. I think that you can do any update. I don't, I don't like. I don't think the exact update matters. Obviously, if we did something super crazy and cool, that'd probably get some people to join. Sure, but when we did, I probably shouldn't have to use that one. Let me find a different one to use. I have so many web browsers open that are just pointless code. They're all pertaining to to code. Like, uh, what is this image of? Oh, that's okay. So, okay, good. I, I just wanted to make sure that I didn't have something up that I didn't know I had up. That's just a map of the newer location. This is server development post for, uh, for data. I mean, like, every single post is pretty much data related. Um, and then the one I'm using this YouTube for is to find the, um, the, uh, God Wars 2 video. Let me find that real quick. So I guess I can't really demonstrate what I was going to. Um, I was going to try to show you the player count in this video, but it turns out at no point in the entire video do I actually show the quest tab with an actual player count. Am I ever at home? No, this is this is when God Wars 2 was released. And um, the point I'm trying to make is that God Wars 2 was one of those updates where uh, there was a lot of hype around it. It was one of my it was one of my original goals for. Uh, you know, for revival. It was one of the, the, the things I knew I wanted to do, and I was definitely going to do it. So, um, it was a big update, and it was one of those ones that people knew about for quite a while. Um, and even though it got 696 views, it didn't really matter. I don't think I don't think it helped the player count a whole lot. I think people who uh, still play the server enjoyed the update. I think there, you know, there was a lot of complaints about the fact that it it wasn't multi and it required, or, or that it wasn't um, instanced and required multiple people. People wanted to just be able to solo AFK it, um, and that didn't happen, so there's people that were mad about that, but uh, the point I'm trying to make is that it, w it was one of those things where we were at, uh, the, the server count 
the player count rather was 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 at uh, at a lower point, and the hope would be that the big massive update that we 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 had God Wars Two would would bring everybody back and solve all of our problems, and that's just not that's just not what happened. And I don't think that's what could happen with Raids 2. I don't think that that would happen. I think if we released Raids 2 and it was as good as I can possibly do, so let's just say most of the mechanics function, it is has all six bosses, they all have animations, the drops, you know, are there and everything. So, assuming all those things, I don't think it would bring that many players back. Let's say right now we have 31, I think maybe it brings five people back. The thing that I've noticed is from the time that I've been playing, and I've, I've been playing a fair bit, um, I'll see a bunch of random people that I, I, I knew back in the day just come and check the server out. Just a bunch of, you know, people that that I hadn't seen play actually play the server in a very long time, but they would come to check it out, and I think that that's just the fact that we've been updating. People want to, you know, check out the new updates, so... Anytime I make an update that's worth a video, I make the video on it. And, and there's a lot of people that keep tabs on the server through videos. Obviously, this video got a good chunk of views. And if I even go to, like, a newer video, um, it'll probably get... Uh, well, the, the, the newest ones, which I don't know if it's just because no one cared about the God Wars. It feels like, I don't know, because I did two videos almost back-to-back, -back, that they got a lot less views. Because even if, like, my feet are a blood talk, a boring video that no one's going to care about. It has so many views less than all the other ones. Still has more than the God Wars 2 from scratch. So I'm guessing this is a sub box issue. Or, I don't know, maybe there's that many people that, that just weren't interested. If you didn't see this video, go check it out. Um, but my point is, like, even, like, these videos, 369, 337, the, the, the worst video that I would think has been uploaded in, like, the last three months. Is a th and I only say that just because there's nothing you know, too important going on, it's just talking. The same with this video, but, you know, this video was neat, and, and uh, you, you can tell why. So, there's, uh, feet of blood, blah, 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 blah. But, um, my point is, there's people that keep tabs on the server, and there's people that are interested in updates, and I think that that's the main thing that's going to, um, to, to, to sort of get the server back into a popularity point that people like. Um, personally, I'm comfortable with a 30 to 40 player base. That doesn't bother me. That doesn't. That's not like I, I think that that amount of player base you can have a lot of fun with. I think that a lot of people would prefer a 300 or 400 player base, and obviously that's what we'd want to strive because you can't really you can't really strive for 30 or 40 players because you'll lose those many. You'll you'll lose players constantly to to just tons of different things. A different game. A player gets just bored of this game. You know, someone a family member has, you know, an illness or something they got to take care of. And there's a billion different reasons why. But but the main thing that I, I I've learned from from the entire year and a half of our survival. We're almost at 2 years and 4 months we will be at the 2 year mark. And uh, in that time, I just learned that if you do updates, people people will come back. That's the main thing. You can advertise. That helps, but not a whole lot. Um, I think we spent over a grand on advertisements the last two, three weeks. And, um, you know, 31 players. So I don't think it's as simple as advertising. I think advertising is getting your name out there. But you have to have something for them to want to do you know there has to be some some updates and some and, and content and whatnot and that's i know that's the main thing that always that always has to happen and I'm, I'm comfortable with that i think we can do that so the point of this video is i think we should delay the release of theater of blood i don't think that it's going to have um a crazy you know impact where we're just going to get 50 players the first day and everyone's going to be happy and i don't think that that's going to happen i think we, we maybe get five or six more players and if it's a bad release, it's going to hurt us more in the long run. I feel like those five or six players would go, oh, this is shitty. I'm going to go play another server that doesn't have a shitty version or just, you know, whatever. But my point is, I think it's a really important piece of content that we shouldn't rush. And I only want to do it if it's going to be done good. I don't think I don't think doing it just to do it to try to get players back is a good call. I think that that's going to... I, I just don't think it worked with God Wars 2. And God Wars 2 wasn't rushed or anything. I'm just saying that God Wars 2 is an equal bit of content to compare it to. It's big, massive bosses with new best-in-slot items. So that's the only reason I mentioned God Wars 2. Because I think God Wars 2 worked out well um, from my end. I know that some players still... I mean, people, people don't complain about it too much anymore, the fact that you, you do require... I mean, people always suggest new stuff, like, oh, make it like Glossa where everyone gets a loot. I'm not doing that. I just think that God... I, I just don't think every single bit of content has to be a AFK instanced. I understand it's a private server. People don't want to put any effort or anything into that. I get that. 
but at the same time, it has to be a little bit of, like, what's the point of having good content or good gear and, like, the max gear and the best in slot gear if there's nothing to kill with that gear, you know what I mean? Some people complained about the fact that you needed best in slot for that stuff. That That's how it should work, though, shouldn't it? What's, like, because, like, what's the point of the best weapon being, let's just say, Rapier is the best weapon, and it kind of is because you use it for most places. And um, what's the point of having it if there's, like, no good boss to use it for? If just having a whip would kill these the same or anything like that. If it's not, fa you know, if it's not much faster. So, I think we should hold off on Theater Blood. I think that I, what I want to do is do some other updates. Finish up some of the stuff that I've, I've been telling people, like, Pearl, Pearl. We gotta get that fixed. Um, we need to figure something out for Pet Bank Space. I have a rough idea, but... I, I don't know when, when I when I put the idea more together I'll explain what my plan is but uh, it's 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 rough just know that much just know just know that much but and we've got we've got other things we could work on before the theater of blood um, and I understand that the theater of blood is already released on on old school RS it was released uh, last year uh, November so we're like four or five months behind I understand that but that's not that's not the server we are though we're not an OSRS clone. There's, 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 there's like 30 servers that are the exact same server. OSPVP, OSRS PVP, RSPK, OSPRS, RSVP, K775, 445, RSPK, 7PK. There's just so many servers that with, that have OS and PK in their name. And they're just com complete one-for-one -one leeches of OSRS. It's probably just all the OSRS data spawning and just tons and tons and tons of, of ways to make money for the server, but... If you want to play those kind of servers, they exist. And there's so many people who are talented and can do them better than me. Like, if you want to know OSRS clone, either play OSRS, because why not? Or just find one of those servers. I, that's not going to be us. So I don't think that rushing that content is going to help us. We're a unique server that, that, that like, like likes to do our own content. So I, I don't think that there's this immediate rush for it. And I think that best in slot, like, I mean, like the tank armor... How is that even going to be... I mean, it's just it looks cool, but I don't know exactly where that would be useful. Maybe here, when these get fixed. I just found out a bug with these. Their max hit is set to 2. 0, 2 instead of 20. So that's why they're really easy. And uh, <laughs> I'm definitely not abusing that or anything. But um, that's going to be fixed by the time you get here, so don't worry about it. <laughs> don't, 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 don't worry about it. But, yeah, the point I'm trying to make in this video is that I think that the theater of blood needs to be done right rather than fast. And I don't think we can do it right right now. So what I want to do is sort of set up the theater of blood. And uh, my my original idea for city expansions was, was to do plenty of them, not just the Zenaris. I I or well actually technically Tizar city counts, but I didn't do enough of that to be honest. Like there probably should be more things improved with that. But either way, so we have uh, Zenaris and Tizar city, and my idea was to produce more of them, or to, to work on more cities and stuff like that, just to sort of spread out the content, add more and different unique ways to do things, and not necessarily always high-end content. I really want to try to focus on lower-end stuff as well. I feel like on private servers, everyone's 126, right? So I'm sure 99% of the players are 126. I'm 126. The three people next to me are all 126. Um, they're 126, right? So there's not a whole lot of need for low content, but not everybody starts off 126. This isn't a sponsor. This isn't OSPK, RSPS, RS7, 7PK, SPS, SS, RS, PSPS. This isn't that server. This is Revival. So there's got to be, I think, I think lower and mid-tier content is, is useful. It's, it's going to help you get your way up to 126 and maxed out. And I think that that's where these cities expansions can really add some new content that, that's diverse. So what I want to do is Mortania. The entire swamp, or whatever you want to call it, of Mortania. Um, I think that there's, there's like, multiple different, like, cities we could sort of incorporate. We could do a little bit here, and a little bit there, a little bit here, a little bit there. I think it could be cool, and I think it makes sense, because we can set up the Theater of Blood, and then hopefully release the Theater of Blood. Um, I suppose my plan would be to have the Theater of Blood, not necessarily ready, but to, to, be, to be able to work on it after this, but... Again, if it isn't ready, I don't think we should rush it. So, we'll see what happens with that. But I think um, I think that's the way to go. I think there's also there. I mean, there's always things we could do. I think there's a lot of you know. There's no shortage of problems that we can fix. I think the the bank space is one that everybody is really um, critical on. That's something we could try to work towards. It's not as simple as just adding bank space. I know people think it is. They're like, oh, it's why not just put five? Why not just make the number five fifty higher? Why not just put in fifty thousand and have us fifty thousand bank space? 
It doesn't work that way. And and I don't know, you know, the full specifics on how it works or why it doesn't work. I know that it's it's pertaining to like lag and whatnot, like you'll cause crashes and stuff like that if we increase the space. I think five fifty was the highest number we could get without noticing any issues at all. And I've seen servers like I think ICOP had a thousand bank space for the highest donators. Um so I'm, I'm not sure, like, their source was obviously different, had different limitations, and they have really good developers, because, you know, I'm sure I'm sure they had salaried developers who were making six figures a year, if not more, I'm just saying. They could pull it off, we couldn't, <laughs> but uh, there's there's workarounds, I, I, I feel. I, like, one of the ones I, I have, and I'll just give you sort of a rough idea of what it is, it's going to be a um, an item that basically stores all skilling pits. So that would be, I think there's 20... Two skills? 23 skills? 21 skills? Uh, definitely not going to count them all right now because I'm way too lazy. I should probably just know how many skills there are. I just I feel... Because, like, I mean... <laughs> technically, we don't have construction, but we technically do because it's invention. So, I, I don't know. 21 skills? Whatever. Either way, that could be 21 bank spaces saved. But the problem is, the way I have it planned is you either have to have all or none of them. And that, that doesn't work. So, I'm, I'm just trying to think of, like, the best way to do it to make the most amount of space available. And that was just one idea, because that would save 21 space. And then we could make another one that was like, um, I don't know, it could include like the God Wars pets, could include the DK pets, or, or you know what I mean? Could, we could make one that was a wilderness, included everything, every single wilderness pet. Um, that's sort of my leaning idea now, but I, I want to come, I wanna, I wanna come up with something for that. And possibly something with Martania, I don't know. I don't know what's, what's all in here, what all we can do. Um, it's definitely a big location with a lot of potential, so if you have any ideas or any suggestions, by all means, suggest them. I have been streaming a lot more, so check out, uh, I, I mean, I, you should get a notification if I stream. If not, I don't know, I don't know. It's, <laughs> I, I stream, like, later in the day most of the time, so, so that's when it would be, but. Yeah, I just want to make this video to give you guys sort of an update on where we're at, what we're thinking. Um, and also you can expect to see some more videos, like I, like I had. I had, uh, I actually released... You know, three videos in four days here. And that almost... I, like, I think that that's the main reason why they didn't get that many views. I'm not sure. So, but yeah, there's there's actual content coming out soon. I have a few ideas for some, some, some you know, some nice videos that, that I have out. Obviously, John is, you know, somewhat back AFK like me. And uh, we can do some PK videos. I want to do, like, an actual PK video soon. Like, where we actually try to, like, PK with, like, real gear. Just because I've made a lot of changes to the PvP... Um, combat mechanics and uh there's no one really to test it because people always want to pking back but i knew that no one would ever pk and obviously they don't pk so i don't really know how well the, the mechanics are most of the people who like experience pking are getting killed by somebody barrage you know crystal halberding them so that's kind of why a lot of people think the, me the mechanics are still fucked up it's just because that the only experience of it is getting rushed and specked out um i think an actual fight would be interesting to watch so definitely gonna have a video out like that soon just to see where it's at and where we, we could possibly improve it further. The thing I've noticed from our mystery box we can it seems like the accuracy is low. It's like the the, the, the defense and the strength are fine, it's the accuracy. Because you'll just hit 0, 0, 46, 0, 0, 38, 0, 0, 0, 37, or just something like that. And I think that that's, uh, you know, that's something we can improve on. And that's kind of why that video would help, just to figure out exactly what issues need to be made. So. I know this was a way longer video than I made. Um, it's probably the longest video I've made in, you know, hear me twice right there, rip. Uh, it's probably the longest video I've made in a long... Well, I guess four weeks ago I made a rambling video about the status for a while, so... I guess I, 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 I underestimate how much I ramble, but... I'm gonna end the video. This has gone on way too long. Thanks for watching. If you did watch this, wow. If you watch this all the way to the end, type, uh... Just PM me in game. Just PM me in game, Panda Bears. Just panda bears, and I'll give you you get your free mystery box, free mystery box. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.